Hello, everybody. So let me show you um, what you can work on and in what order. The order is important. So let's go into the environmental stewardship quest because that comes first. Okay, so right now, do you have the water pollution vocabulary? If you don't have it, you need to finish your PSA. You need to um, make sure of two things. All right, first thing is on the Google Classroom assignment. Make sure your blog link is there. It has to be a link to your actual blog post. The post you wrote for uh, uh, your public service announcement. Not just to your blog, and I don't want it to this. I don't want to see anything with blogger.com because you can see that, but I can't. I know, you're probably like, Mr. G, come on, you say that every day. But people are still giving me this link. So if it's you, stop it. Okay, so if you got your document and your blog link there, and you've turned it in, uh, you're good. So turn it in only when you're done. Oh my goodness, spell check. Use Grammarly. Grammar check. Read it back to yourself. I should be giving you feedback on your content, your message. Is it making an impact? How can you do that better? I don't want to be spending my time saying, oh, you didn't capitalize the first letter of every sentence. Oh, you don't have periods in this entire paragraph. That's not for me to do. That's for you to do. Come on, you're old enough now to grammar check and spell check your own work. So take the time to do it right before you click turn in. All right? So once you've turned it in, you're good to go here. Now. It's got to wait till I read it, so you may not have this right away. Let's review what you do. So you're going to go to your science. I can do it from right here. Um, actually, let me pick a different one. Let's pick A1, because I'm using my A1 account. Go to Classwork. Go to Water Pollution Vocab. And if you're on your computer, do the web link. All right, so remember, you have to allow... And the quiz is you want to practice because the better you get at it, uh, the better you'll do on the boss battle and or the gym kit. So you got to get 100% three times in a row to complete the assignment. If you don't get 100% three times in a row, don't complete the assignment. Keep taking the quiz. This is how you learn. Memorization is done through repetition. You want to know what these concepts mean. Because there's a lot you're learning there, okay? So make sure you do that. All right. So now you're done with all that. You're good to go. You're like, all right, Mr. G, I'm ready for the next activity. Uh, so go back to quests. Because for the next activity, while you're waiting for your classmates to catch up, is found in the learning through play uh, quest. Now, way back in December, when we had Computer Science Education Week, your task was to do one of these three. Either coding games, an hour of code Minecraft, or bonus conditional statements, if-then statements. Now, this one, if you're in school, you can't do this one and the two that follow it, because you need to use uh, a computer where you have Fortnite. These three are awesome Fortnite programming activities using Fortnite Creative. You know what? Fortnite is free. Even if you don't like Fortnite, you really should do these at home uh, because they're very cool. And I recorded a video showing how I did it so you can see how cool it is. Um, I wonder if I did a video. I think I did a video for one of the... Yep, I did a video for the obstacle course. I made myself an obstacle course. And I even did the treasure hunt. I tried them, and they're so much fun. But if you're in school right now, and you didn't finish an hour of code with Minecraft or coding games, you want to do one of these two. This one is using an hour of code. In order to complete it, read the instructions, because some people are turning this in, and they didn't even answer any of these questions. So you have to go to assignment, and you have to type the answers to all these questions. Okay? You, you have to. 
Otherwise, it's not going to get approved. Now, if you want to, while you're in class, do this one. Come on. You might remember I said this was really fun. So here are the questions for this one. There's the Minecraft world. Download the Minecraft world. Double click to open it. You'll use your Microsoft Education Edition account. Play the game. Answer these questions. All right, so that's your first thing. You got to finish one of those. Any one of those you finish will take you to Adaptation Games. That's the activity I wanted you to work on. Uh, so what you're going to do is I've created a playlist of science adaptation games from Legends of Learning. But I need you to not just play them to learn about science adaptation, adaptations in living things, uh, but I need you to rate them for me because... I, some of them I don't think are as good as others, and I need you to tell me, is the game fun to play? Rate it from 1 to 5, where 5 is fun. Does the game teach you anything about adaptations? Rate it from 1 to 5, where 5 is, you learned a lot. And then I need you to rate it on playability, where 5 is, yeah, I can play this game more than once. Okay, so the assignment, open on Google Doc and you need to attach something. So I gave you this. Oh, not that. Where is it? Oh, it's on story. I gave you this. All right, it's gonna make a copy for you. And take the copy and change it to your name. I'm gonna call this one A1 Test 1, okay? Now, watch this. You're going to add it. You always want to add your documents to here. So go to Google Drive, the most recent one. I just did it, so click on it, all right? Insert. There you go. Now you're going to use this document to rate the games. There they are. Game number one is called Adapt. Number two is Adapt or Die. Three is the Adaptation Game. Four is Escape Adaptation. And five is the Adaptation Crises. So you're going to give them a score from one to five and then write me a review. I scored this one low because it was boring and it didn't teach me anything. Every game, you're going to rate them and write me a review. So you have to play them. You have to play them in order. It's the only way. And here's the link. You got to log in with Google and join. It's that easy. It'll launch the first game. All right, if you have any questions, message me. I might be able to respond. If I'm in class with you, call me over and ask me. But this is it, folks. This is what I need you to do. Good luck. Have fun. Learn lots. And I'll see you later.